All right. I had the sound on. I heard the bleep. I'm not staring into space looking silly. Yeah. I'm wearing what you might know as a pair of white pyjamas. But this is actually my gi. I've just got back from Aikido training. And, and it's what we wear. It's like, because it's like a big pyjama party. We all cuddle and, you know, take teddies and all that kind of stuff. No, but seriously though, normally um, you wear a white gi like this. Dogi. It is a Japanese piece of equipment. Well, it's not. It's more of a uniform. But, however, <laughs> once you get to the grade that I've just achieved in my particular club, which is the first Q, you get a rather fetching pair of trousers. Also, also, you might be, you might uh, might confuse you for a man skirt. But uh, I'll show you. I'll show you what it looks like. I don't know if you can see that, but it's a, it's a very fetching, very wide pair of trousers um, called the Hakama. And the samurai used to wear them. So before you start calling me a cross-dresser or insulting me, samurai clothing. How many people, put your hands up today, anyone that's watching this, if you're wearing what a samurai used to wear. Your argument is invalid, but yeah, yeah, it really odd uh, training in uh, baggy trousers, did it, did it, baggy trousers. Normally when people first get these, they sort of trap the legs and fall over and look pretty stupid and I've probably fastened it wrong. So if you are into Aikido or Aido or anything that uses a uh, Hakama, please feel free to tell me how to fasten the flipping thing and how to get it off. So I also uh, got this little, this little plaque. If you follow me on... Instagram or Facebook or anything, you may have seen. Look at that! Look, look at that phone. This is this was for achieving the uh, the trophy, the Ted Price Cup last year. Ted Price being one of the founders of the club, passed away sadly, and we honour his memory every year by the person who's advanced the most gets the uh, gets the cup, and then after you give the cup back after you, you get the shield. Thought I'd share that with you. I know you're dying to find out about that kind of stuff. I would be if I were you. Cup's not there anymore. We've already established that. But look, what's on the cooker? Some chicken fillets. And uh, I'm going to eat them because it's this is how late I get in. What time? It's now 200 degrees. That's the time. It's normally the time if I haven't got the oven on. But the time now is late. It's probably about oh actually, let's have a look on this uh, this little device here. What time is it? 9:35. Not too bad actually. 9:35. So after a day in the office, an evening in the gym, and then an evening in the keto, 9:35. That's why I never turn that on. Okay, so every time you say to me, did you watch X Factor? Did you watch blah blah blah? No! I'm too busy wearing a skirt, rolling around with men. And the odd woman. Not the odd woman. Anyway, besides all that. Yeah, I just thought I'd, I'd uh, you know, I'd, I'd mention it because um, a few of you did ask, you know, did I get, did I pass the grade in and this, that and the other. And I did. All thanks to these boxes that are getting in my way so much, I just want to throw them out of the window with my... Aikido skills that I haven't got and never will have, but uh, I keep trying. I might get there. I might get there. So yeah, it's tea time now. You lot have probably already did tea, unless you're in another country and it's not tea time yet, or you don't know what tea time is because people call it dinner. If the posh, me I call it tea. It's just what I like. And yeah, and down on the, uh, the the table, we've got the camera tripod set because of this. What's this? It's another phone. A phone that's that was not actually a phone in fairness. I've got a shake going on there. Sorry if you're feeling sick But yeah, it's one of them cameras that you put a sim card in and you can take pictures We are right big zoom. So if you're into Technology and Android and cameras look out for that and uh, I'm gonna be doing a little bit of work with a chap I know called Christian Cable who's a I like to say I oh, nearly said pro amateur, but I just say he's a pro. He's a photographer type and uh, I'm going to I'm going to loan it to him uh, and he's going to use it and he's going to feed back to me by the uh, by a, by the out of video what he thinks of it from a proper camera person point of view but first I'm going to have a go of it and see what I can do so yeah <laughs> look out for that um three I say three people I've got close to 1100 and something subscribers on there now insanity fight do 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 so yeah the battery's charged what a tip. I can't believe I show you around this place. Trust me, the next place can be a lot cleaner than this. Not that it's dirty, it's just messy. Bit of a difference. Uh, yeah, so the battery's charged, so that I can put it in the Dussler. And, because I haven't, believe it or not, and everyone like who knows I've got this thing, look! 
it's sealed. It's sealed. That's how important wearing a skirt is. I leave my gadgets sealed until I get in and I've even got to have my tea first. So just a quick update. I must have been talking for about five minutes, 18, 20, five minutes, 20 seconds, something like that. Yeah, five twenty, something like that. So I'm going to get off now and I'm going to eat my chicken after it's cooked and I'm going to unbox the camera like you do. Take care now. Bye bye then. Oh, spinner. Mm -hmm.